regional semifinals. It's all coming up on AT&T at the half. I'd love to get a piece of the lane on this ball screen. If you cover, they kick just like that. And they shoot from three. Game of good luck. Coach Cheney, Coach Olson, Coach Lou Henson. That's a great yeah, name. an incredible stretch of um, sad news that it was terrible. In recent months. You're right. Robinson Earl. I love to see this kid just confident to take it. Tournament titles coming in. They've won seven straight. Archie Diakono is right here. Now the Wildcats of Villanova have lost two games. And we're standing just a bit too low. Have to be in the one seat. Inside with three long inside. With chemistry now moving forward without a Colin Gillespie. But you know what? And two for Chris. It's a matter of doing what he's doing now, which is running the offense, getting guys set, and you have a shot by Villanova. Well, here's the scary thing for Villanova. As they continue to miss threes, George has two guards, uh, both Tati, Blair, and Harris. Harris was the star of the second half last night. Robinson Earl trying to carry his... Robinson Earl again. Off the heel for Daniels. Run down by Robinson Earl. A recycle coming. Robinson Earl again. Nice job by Duke. In positions they're not used to being right. put in for Villanova. And run the baseline. Link to the floor. Robinson Earl for the win. Oh, don't go. I'm not sure if that. So again, this is how they seize control of the game. Take away your energy a little bit. Samuels facing off senior night. Robinson Earl. They were in a face-off at the end of one years ago in high school. Of course, Kobe did not play at the collegiate level. Robinson Earl, an air ball this time title game and young Terry Gannon was trying to guard him on a breakaway and he hugged him. He actually tackled him and it turned into an offensive foul which helped Houston get into foul difficulty. I know that was before your time. <laughs> Robinson Earl not there. And they clear out. He is active early, scores it inside with the layup. Justin Moore had that high ankle sprain, knocked him out of the last regular season game, came back in the Big East tournament, was a little unsettled in that game. Villanova lost to Georgetown after winning a regular season title. But all this time off and time together has really helped both programs as Butler goes strong. Turns it over. Rare occasion for Villanova, one of the best teams in protecting the basketball in college basketball. He dodged one in that early offense when they get these clean looks. That ball really moves. Damian Jefferson to the hole with the gliding fist. That was really just poor location. When you get back in transition, you have to find these guys because they're all standing outside the three-point line. You know it. Mike Anderson told them that, and they were late getting to Jermaine Samuels. A 20-point Villanova lead, which is down to 18 after the... He gave him a foul last time, but... Creighton has been far too comfortable going against the man-to-man. -man. Yeah, muck it up a little bit, right? Yes. <laughs> Jefferson, a blowback. How did you control the pace of this game? He said early they hurt us on the glass, but then we played bigger, and we were able to defend so they couldn't get easy looks. He said on offense, we were the aggressor on the offensive glass, which paid off. He said we all know they are great shooters. They will get hot. We have to withstand their run. I also talked to Coach Drew as they get it early. Which has aided Ed's team through the years. Well, you roll out of bed, and you're right here in, in, in Alumni Hall. <laughs> Inside work and rattling it home is Watson, which has aided Ed's team through the years. Well, you roll out of bed and you're right here in, in, in Alumni Hall. Inside work and 
rattling at home. There's puts a starter to the last guy on the bench, but there's just been a, a different relationship with Gillespie since he's been at Villanova. And Jay has said this is the best leader he has ever coached at Villanova. It's saying a lot. And he doesn't even mention about his shooting and his yeah. passing. He yeah. just talks about him as a kid and his leadership. Watson gets the roll. Colin Gillespie catches Inzi off guard. Lucky to get it back. Defended by Jeremiah Robinson Earl. Ninzi around Earl.